until about a year ago, my life was pretty normal. I lived in the greatest place ever. Brooklyn, represent, had two cool parents, and loved all things science and superheroes. Everything changed, though, when my dad was killed in the city hall bombing. I, I couldn't believe he was gone. But Peter Parker and his Aunt May, they were there for me. And so was Spider-Man, who I later found out was Pete. Crazy, right? Then when the Devil's Breath crisis started, things got intense. It seemed like all of Spidey's villains were on the loose. I managed to do my part to help him out. And after all that, believe it or not, a spider bit me. And I started to change. I didn't want to worry my mom, so I went to Pete. And now, we're officially Spider Bros. He's been training me up, and I'm actually getting pretty good with this whole web swinging thing. I'm still learning to juggle this responsibility with everything else in my life. School, friends, a new home. I moved to Harlem a few weeks back. But I'll tell you, I can't wait to see what the future holds. That is so cool. I got you. Hey, thanks. No problem. Hey, uh, you think you're gonna add that new Spider-Man too? The key? Yeah, uh, maybe. Original's just my guy, you know? Yeah, I know. Hey, is Tails Bodega around here? Yeah, bright yellow sign down the block. Can't miss it. Thanks. Beautiful work, by the way. Maybe leave a little room for the new guy. Just in case.
Okay, be cool. Be cool. Helping Spider-Man protect the giant prison convoy? You can handle this. Breathe in, breathe out. Be cool. Just down in some rocket fuel. How are you drinking? Very, very carefully. Okay, go time. Helix 2 on route, heavy payload. Copy, Helix 2, we've got you on scope. This is a big operation. It's gotta be. Hundreds of felons escaped from the raft last year. Now it's time to move them back in. Police aren't taking any chances. Especially not with our guest of honor. Getting a lot of interference here. One of those guys who helped Doc Doc is in there? I think so. Could be Vulture, could be Scorpion, could be someone bigger. Okay, we got a problem. Hold back, Miles. Let me take. I got this beat. Don't worry. Oh, no! <laughs> it's secure. You're drifting Helix 2. We have a weight imbalance. Corrector 2, 3, 6. Rudder's unresponsive. Brace for impact. Helix 2, going down. Helix 2 is going down. Response team dispatched. Sit tight, Helix 2. Peter, I'm sorry, man. I, I didn't mean to. It's okay. We got this. Just need to contain it before... Before that happens. Hello, tiny spiders. Alexei! 
That's not good. Oh, hey, sorry, I'm out of One to ten. How are we doing? Ten for generating spectacles, one for minimizing destruction. Tomorrow's bugle headline's gonna be a doozy. Worst thing out of this is a bad headline? I'm gonna count as lucky. Oh crap, crap, the winter bad! Hey, this is starting to feel real bad, man. Uh, don't think like that. We're going to stop him as long as we work together. Up. I'm giving you a hand up here. Yeah. Yeah. I got you. Okay, Pete. Yeah. I got this. Take it away, Capo. Oh, whoa, wait. That's the ball. Hang on tight, tiny spider. Spider-Man, hey. You need a little help? Hey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh. He's a weak minded! Oh! Hey, Jonah! Let me do it! Very fast! Menace! A feckless, treacherous, unhinged menace! Get out of here! Right here! Yeah! Mijo, ¿dónde está? It's getting late. Hey! Mom! Yeah! Coconut milk. They'll try to find it. Been kind of, uh, an adventure. Are you running? Yeah, uh, sorry. I'm trying to catch a train. Mira, mijo. No seas mentido. Let the milk and hurry home, please. Sí, ma. Te quiero mucho. Yo también te quiero. Now we're never miles. We gotta stop him. On my way. We gotta bring him down fast. Yeah. Yeah, what do we do? Let us raise temperature. Oh, bad, bad, very bad. Pete, are you okay? No. Oh, no, no, no! I'm okay. I've got him. Headed your way. Be ready. Okay. Yeah. Might, uh, need a minute.
Hang on, man. Hang on. You're not getting away with that. He needs me. I got him. Spider-Man, you good?
guys. Wow, just... <laughs> wow. Simon Krieger, head of R&D at Roxxon Energy. Pleasure to meet you. You too. Uh, sorry. I think our ball landed in your yard. No. Actually did us a favor. We uh, just bought the place. Uh, we're planning to tear it down for a build. But uh, looks like you beat us to it. I wanted to thank you. Both of you. Taking down Rhino? Solo? <laughs> you are going places, bud. Thanks. But he, he's still dangerous. Nah, we'll hold him for the police. You know, I always think these super troopers are overkill until mm, something like this happens. Oh, duty calls. Hey, uh, really great to meet you both. <laughs> Future's looking bright. Hello. Hey. He's right. Yeah. Let's clear out. Let the police do their job. Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Bioelectricity. Wow. Gotta be honest, a little jealous. Hey, look. I got nothing on the OG. Think we should run tests tomorrow? A little voltage analysis? Oh, man. Yeah, sorry. I've been meaning to tell you, I'm not gonna be around for the next few weeks. This is some kind of pee joke I don't get? No. Uh, MJ's headed overseas for the bugle and requested me as her photographer. Kind of a working vacation for us. Oh, man. Look, I don't know if I'm ready to fly solo. I screwed up today big time with the helicopter. But then you delivered big time. You saved my bacon, Miles. I got lucky. Hey, I did this gig for eight years without backup, and you better believe I screwed up lots of times. But that is how you learn. What's this? Christmas present. But first, you gotta take the oath. Oh. Um, okay. I promise to do everything in my power to protect this city. I promise. That's it? That oath a real thing. Totally. Definitely didn't just make it up. See you in a few weeks, Spider-Man. New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. Please don't screw this up. The city late at night hit a pinnacle. Shining on the map, I did the long for those on the game. Invisible, so I keep a lot of vision. Every night I try to read your mind and see you see your eyes. Oh, let me catch a lie while wasting time. So Yo, Genki! Dude! Rhino? What? Yeah. Where you at? You get into the apartment, okay? Yeah, your mom let me in. Unpack slash dump my stuff all over your floor. And now I'm in the park. You got some air. Oh, perfect! Dip over to the amphitheater. Got something to show you. Dude, is this spider related? Please tell me you got a piece of rhino's horn or something. Pics I've seen of the fight are straight up nuts. <laughs> definitely spider related. And definitely better than a horn. Oh, loving the suspense. I'm there. I'll never get used to you doing that. Hey, look, check it. Christmas present from Spider-Man. Open it. Dude, put it on. I'll cover you. Oh. What? Never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? Whoa. Miles Morales, congratulations.
Congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. This is only half of the present. Well, what's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Welcome to Just the Facts with me, your truth slinging host with the most, J. Jonah James. What? Does Pete said his suits the autoplay Jameson show? Guys, a masochist. Sad news, listeners. My Christmas charity spectacular was canceled due to mass vigilante mayhem. Gotta be something better on. Uh, been hearing good things about this one. Hello, I'm Janet Hart, and this is the Danicast, where I spotlight the people making a real difference in our city. Today's topic, uh, you know, stockbrokers, coffee colleges, link internet videos, autoplay. <laughs> No, obviously we're covering the Spider-Man's incredible takedown of Rhino. Subscribe, Dana Cast, new favorite podcast. <laughs> this is the place. Looks like Pete set up a lot of gear. Miles, get ready for your first holographic training challenge. These challenges are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. First up, air combat. Fighting the enemy on your terms is a great way to gain the advantage. Detect. All right, yeah, this is dope. Bless Peter Parker. Another key fighter skill is Here! Catch! Fire one More guys incoming. Heads up! Time for some free form practice. Air combat is starting to eliminate these enemies. Dale, trata. Tech gear we can sell. <laughs> oh crap. Spider! <laughs> Take them out! Then grab the gear! You all trying to catch some hands? Yeah? Okay, let's go! <laughs> Take the spider out and grab the tech gear! I'm gonna make the bank selling this stuff off! Just so you know, this is official Spider-Man tech! Y'all are not authorized to be sell! <laughs> How are these guys see through? Fix a training sim. Colonel Panic. Well, let's try a BIOS reset. Nice! That did it. it. Looks like Pete made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. Gotta check these out when I get a chance.
Hey dude, I think you should check out Roxxon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, yeah, I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider powers. I think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge or supercharged static electricity. Ooh, we gotta name it. How about venom power? You know, because it stings. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, venom power. Trust me, it's gold. about this podcast we've jumped the charts from 136 to 87 like uh wow <laughs> okay okay moving. today i'm doing a quick cast before i head downtown for my citizen test and i'm answering fan dms first one where are you from danica well i was born in fuzhou china but we came to new york when i was six next question what kind of mic do you use uh purple <laughs> Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan, and then worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuform. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? Hmm. No sign of anybody. They broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. They did a search for new food. What were they gonna do with it? Uh, uh! Man, this night was just not quit. Their tech is unbelievable, but Venom's totally back. Yeah, Yankee's right. Venom's a good name. Keep him down here! Hold him here! Everyone else, get up there! He just broke my gauntlet! I haven't seen you guys before. Nice glow sticks. More of them up on the balcony. What are these weapons? Memory metal? Heads up! Oh, whatever! 
stuff in the reactor? Ah, it's not installed yet. They're talking about shipments. Weird. Super weird. Hey, I did that grocery shopping your mom wanted, but she's wondering where you are. The dinner's almost ready. Crap. Okay. I'll try to wrap this up. Thanks, man. The new form into the plaza. Calm down, how? Talking about new form shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. They were tracking new form shipments, but why? <laughs> Rocks on security. They can take it from here. Yeah. Gotta look into this later. Get home. Christmas dinner's sounding pretty good right about now. I'll look into that group and the new form shipments tomorrow. Middle school graduation. Haven't seen these two in a while. What was that? All good. Little spill. Get it cleaned up real quick. All good. <laughs> it's all right, man. Ay, bendito. Mijo, qué guapo. <laughs> Gracias, mami. I invited a guest tonight. Can you get the apartment ready? Oh, uh, maybe put on some music, set the mood? Ah, oh, Naja. Really? Your campaign manager on Christmas Eve? Well, tomorrow's rally isn't going to plan itself. Thanks for getting the apartment ready, mijo. Hello? <laughs> Glad Dad's tree survived the move. Me too. He loved that little guy. Ain't no Christmas like a Brooklyn Christmas. Miss hearing him say that. Fifteen years in Brooklyn without a stain. Then we moved to Harlem. Might be a sign. I'm gonna make you proud, Dad. Hmm. No records. Hey, Mom. Where's Dad's vinyl? Um, should be in my room. Thanks. El dijo que? No, no, no te creo. Este hombre está loco. Guess mom's not done unpacking either. That wallpaper just screams abuela. Well, what's that? Huh. Must have gotten mixed up in the move. One of dad's old case files. 
Who's the prowler? I wonder if Dad ever caught the guy. I haven't looked through these since before City Hall. Dad's favorite album. He put this on every Sunday while he made coffee. Oh, <laughs> salsa from Abuela. Mom and Dad would move when this came on. Mom ordered like a hundred of these because the article mentioned Dad. Who is the Spider-Man? If only you knew, Ma. Bleached borax. Uh, borax with bleach. Boraxed bleach. Hey, man, you guys have any regular bleach bleach? You sure bleach is a good idea? Yeah, for sure. Why? No reason. What's the pick, DJ? The greatest record ever. Oh, I love this one. Will you be dancing for us this evening? Dinner and a show? Ha! <laughs> no. That doorbell's been broken for years. Miles, could you get that? Of course. How are you? Finn? Hey. Fixed your doorbell. <laughs> it's so good to see you. How are you? It's been like... Months. A lot's changed. Yeah. It really has. Is that our guest of honor? Come on in, you two. Dinner's almost ready. Finn, I'm so glad you could make it. Thanks for inviting me, Miss Morales. <laughs> we missed you. Well, this one especially. <laughs> uh, hi. Finn, this is Genki, my friend from Brooklyn Visions Academy. Genki, this is Finn, my best friend. <laughs> my other best friend. <laughs> Oh, yeah. You guys won the middle school science fair at county, right? You made a, uh... Energy, energy converter? converter? Jinx! <laughs> oh. uh. The wiring in this building is such a mess. I'll check the circuit breaker. Gracias. So, Christmas by candlelight? I promise I didn't break it when I fixed your doorbell. I hadn't considered that. No good. Breaker doesn't have power. Looks like the whole block's out. Let me check if I can see anything from the fire escape. Okay, honey, but be safe. Definitely can't get to the transformer from here. Unless you're super sticky. Can you see any other buildings out? People on the roof. Can't go up there. Yeah, got the whole block. Really hope no one can see me up here. Electricity can take down Rhino, but can it save Christmas dinner? Come on, it worked. Oh man, those lights are bright. Did not think this through. Gotta get back inside ASAP. Keep them distracted, Genki. Come on, Genki. Is Miles still outside? Actually, oh. uh, what about a photo? <laughs> right now? Yeah, you know, precious moments. You gotta capture them. Shouldn't we wait for Miles? No, he hates photos. <laughs> All right, everyone squeeze in. Ready? Great photo, great photo. Oh, hey, Miles. Uh, who's ready to eat? You guys sit down. I got this. Mm, smells good. Mm. <laughs>
<sighs> Finn, tell us everything you've been up to. You still in robotics club? I had to quit, but I've been studying biotech on my own. Nerd. Ugh, says the guy who has to wear an ascot to school. <laughs> hey, only on Tuesdays. <laughs> Does your brother Rick still work for Roxon? I don't know how anyone could work there after seeing your last campaign ad. You went for Simon Krieger's jugular. <laughs> that reminds me. Genki, you have a certain flair for social media. Could you spread the word about tomorrow's rally? Yeah, we'll be trending by midnight. Sometimes it feels like Simon Krieger's my real opponent. Roxon has so much influence here, but they don't answer to anyone except their shareholders. Harlem needs someone to fight for the community. That's Mom's campaign speech voice, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, you want to proofread these before I post them? Yes! Do not hit send! <gasps> <laughs> So, what's going on with you? What do you mean? You seem... I don't know. Distracted. Want to talk about it? Not tonight. It's Christmas. Hey, how are you handling the move from Brooklyn? I mean... It's fine. Ugh. You hate it. No. Nah. That's your, I hate it, but I'm too nice to say it voice. No. It's... I don't know anybody here, and I'm always having to ask for directions. You need to find a good restaurant, a barber shop, somewhere you can shoot hoops. You'll settle in. What if we hang out tomorrow? Just the two of us. You're not too busy? It's winter break. I can put off homework for at least another week. Okay, I'll text you. It's a date. I, I mean, N not a date, uh, you know, a, a friend date. Still as smooth as the last time I saw you. <laughs> <laughs>